Alright guys, this is Black. I got a really good battle versus Cosmic Jeff from Smogon. And this battle was for One Winged Angels Battle Frontier thing. So, yeah. Apparently a lot of people watch my battles, so I'll try to do a better job of narrating from now on. I won't just say like random shit. So, yeah, he leads off with Reva and I go with my Metagross and he uses fake out which tells me it's probably one of those counter focus as weavile leads and i don't want to take the counter so i go to my fortress and i'm guessing he predicted my switch or maybe it's not a counter slash weavile but crit knight slash does shit so i'm in a good position here he can't really touch fortress so i set up some stealth rock and he goes to tyranitar and that automatically tells me it has some kind of fire move like fire punch or fire fang or fire blast something so I go to Gyarados to resist it and yeah he has fire blast so Gyarados takes it nicely and I take a risk right here and use body slam hoping he might switch but he doesn't switch he goes for the stone edge and that kills Gyarados practically and yeah I don't get the pair of hacks so he predicts a switch I'm thinking or I don't know but he used dragon dance and I go for the waterfall and doesn't kill but took a fat chunk and that thing is pretty much dead so that's good for me and he he uses hidden power I'm guessing it's grass for like swamper but I don't know and yeah I go to my um, Metagross I have bullet punch so I'm hoping he won't predict that and switch out and he doesn't or maybe he just wanted to leave him in I don't know but yeah Metagross finishes off the Tyranitar he goes to Heatran and this thing is going to come cause me a lot of problems because it's not one of those scar Heatrans one of those bulky ass wall Heatrans and yeah he uses earth power and that does pitiful damage to my wall fucking Umbreon is just beast like that and yeah lava plumes again and I predict the switch and toxic but he doesn't switch so yeah that was like a wasted ass turn for me so he he earth powers and my shit is like practically dead so I'm gonna wish up and he gets the special defense drop so it's a pretty damn good thing that I wished right there because now I can just protect this turn and the wish will heal my HP and I'll withdraw and bring that shit back in so yeah that happens I get my HP back but the damn Heatran is still sitting at max HP and I had to switch because he got the special defense dropped so unfortunately I gotta go to my Machamp which is the only thing I, I have that could take a fire move the rest of my shit is too frail or weak to fire so Machamp was the only thing I could do and yeah he doesn't want his Heatran dead so he goes to his Swamper and I use Dynamic Punch and that takes a fat ass chunk so I'm in good shape right here and he uses Stealth Rock right here and I get a crit Dynamic Punch which I'm not sure if it mattered or not because the chances were that he would have hit himself in confusion the next turn so I got lucky right there I guess and he goes to Lucario and I don't want to take a close combat and I go to Gengar and close combat doesn't do shit to Gengar so I'm predicting the switch to the Heatran again so I use Focus Blast and he brings out a Suicune and Focus Blast misses that's not good for me I don't want to leave Gengar in here I need the Gengar for other shit and yeah he uses Calm Mind and he's gonna try to set up on my Umbreon and the only thing I can do is toxic the thing and hope he doesn't have rest and then just stall the shit out with like protect but he Calm Minds again and I wish just in case he wanted to attack and yeah he finally uses rest and that gives me a chance to go to my Machamp again hoping the, the thing doesn't have sleep talk if it has sleep talk then I'm in real big trouble 
And he doesn't use sleep talk, so that's really good for me. And my chance is going to take some fat chunks from that shit. I go for the dynamic punch, and that did a lot. And, yeah. So, I get the confusion on him, and he wakes up, hits himself. That's a 50% chance, so this turn, the chances are he won't hit himself. And, yeah, he doesn't hit himself, so not too much luck, I guess. Or, I don't know. But, yeah. I bring in Meta Rose because I checked and to see how much speed Suicune runs. And my Meta Rose is going to be faster unless he had, like, some random ass speed EVs. So, he brings in Heatran again. And I don't want to take the Lava Plume. So I withdraw to my Umbreon again. And the only problem that Umbreon has is against Heatran because Payback does pitiful damage. I swear that shit does like fucking 12 HP damage every every turn. And he burned me so that's even worse. My shit is going to die. And look, Payback does like shit, man. So whatever. I had to leave this thing in here and yeah he goes for the lava plume and he burns me and I wish and shit and because because I'm burned I just wish cause I want Gengar back at full health so I bring back in Gengar and I'm gonna focus blast he said he m misclicked right here he said he what the fuck was that he said he misclicked and he he said he was trying to go to Lucario which would have died to the focus blast and I had Metagross to finish off the Weavile with bullet punch so I don't think it mattered too much but whatever he brings Lucario back in and I don't want to risk focus blast missing so yeah I go to my fortress and he uses ice punch and that does like shit and I'm in a good position here and this this is the key play right here Everstone's fortress has earthquake for this reason right here everyone likes to bring in heatran on fortress and i fuck them shits up with earthquake it's quad weak and i still didn't kill but it doesn't matter fortress is meant as a wall not as a sweeper or a tank so i had to let the thing go and i could bring in my heat my my gengar pretty safely and try to kill the heatran so yeah, I'm hoping Thunderbolt will KO. I could have went for Focus Blast. I didn't want to risk the miss though. And it doesn't KO. But I live, so that's good for me. And yeah, that's the problem with those bulky Heatrans. They don't really have as much special attack power and shit. So yeah, Gengar lives, but he has to go down to the Sandstorm. And he goes to Lucario, and I know my Metagross could take a close combat, so good game, comment, rate, all that shit, and I'm out. He said he